deserve. Better late than never. Yeah. Sure. Thanks, Doody. Now, experts are warning that the risk for children drowning this summer is much higher than normal because COVID has meant cancelled swimming lessons. Swimming legend Liesl Jones, who is poolside in Brisbane, is here to share how we can make up for lost time. Liesl Jones, we love you. Thank you so much for joining us today. Um, isn't it to learn that one in two children, so half of kids, have missed out on swimming lessons due to COVID? It's a little bit frightening. Up to 54% of children are actually not in swimming lessons at the moment. We can blame COVID for a little bit of it, but there's also availability as well, which is a big mm. issue. But swimming is a life skill. It can actually save lives. So I've had a few close people to me in my life that have had incidents with drowning. Uh, one of them actually happening this year to an older person. So it's really important that we've got our kids learning to swim. Look how much fun they're having. They've got yeah. their big <laughs> rocket arms. Absolutely gorgeous little kids. But also we need availability. We need swimming teachers as well. You had Nicolene on before. She was talking about older people transitioning into new careers. Why not be a swim teacher? It's a great job. You can be out in the sun. You can teach kids to swim. It's such a good job. Oh, it is great. Our own kids are back in swimming now as well. Mine love being in the water, but they're a little bit nervous, mm. uh, which, which you can expect. I guess there's a fear that it might be too late now uh, to make up for all those lost lessons in time for summer. Never too late to learn to swim. You can always learn to swim at any age. Doesn't matter how old you are. I learned to swim when I was two. But you can be any age. There's no time that goes by that is not important for you to for kids to learn to swim. So get them in at any age. They can be older. My mum's a learn to swim teacher. She has been for 34 years and she teaches adults to swim. So it's never too late to learn to swim. Hey, Lisa, how do you build up confidence in kids that might be a little bit nervous in the water? The big thing is having fun. That's the most important thing. Kids have got to be have fun around water to be safe. So we've also got the PJ masks in the background, if you can see them. <laughs> kids love them. Yeah. They're the absolute greatest things. Kids love the PJ masks. So it's all about having fun, really enjoying swimming, and just get really confident in the water. That's the thing. You can see they're jumping in, they're really confident, and it's just about having fun around water, but being really safe as well. Yeah. Yeah, That's I, I guess as parents, well, what's the most important thing that we as parents need to know, I guess, to, to, to help prevent drownings? Well, for parents, it's about being there as well and making sure you're watching your children. Mm. So get them into swimming lessons as early as possible is a great start. Also making sure that you're consistent. So being consistent around water, making sure you're always watching your children, that's a big thing for parents. But get involved. Always be a part of your sw child's swimming lessons. That's a big thing. So really being consistent, get them started, get them going and keep them going. Yeah. How, how, do, how do we get behind Swim It Forward, Liesl? What is it? So Swim It Forward is about paying it forward for other parents that maybe are a little bit in a bit of financial difficulty. So it's about really being kind and pushing it forward for parents to be able to almost donate a swimming lesson for someone that maybe can't afford swimming lessons. So oh, we do oh, know yeah. that swimming is it can be a little bit expensive, but mm. we're such a multicultural country. We've got so many people from many different backgrounds in this country. And it's about being kind and paying it forward. So it's $20 to pay it forward forward for another parent to be able to get their child into swimming as well and making sure that they're safe. That is such a beautiful yep. idea. To find out more, head to the website on your screen now. Liesl Jones, you are wonderful. Thank you so much for chatting today. My pleasure. Bye. Take care. That's great. Mm. Um, now, coming up soon, the